This is a small video to remind you to be mindful of your brush strokes. I used thick paint and a chip brush to really exaggerate my point, but the fact is the way you apply paint matters and has consequences for your later steps. Linear brush strokes are good for things that have a natural linear direction to them, like wood grain, but would be a bad choice for things like stone. For a lot of things, it is better to start with an X, V, or figure 8 brush stroke. Not only do you avoid unnaturally straight lines, but it is really helpful for working the paint into grooves and uneven surfaces. Changing your brush strokes like this will help you avoid holidays and uneven paint. Scenic artists frequently use X, V, and figure 8 strokes for starching backdrops as well to make sure the starch is properly worked into the muslin. To demonstrate how your initial brush strokes have bearing on the layers you put on top, I sealed this with gloss and a chip brush to again exaggerate the effect. From this, you can see that the sealer layer looks bad if it is done differently than the bottom layer. When it goes against the grain, it just looks odd, and this would be true for additional paint layers, not just a sealer. Now of course, each project is unique, and honestly, you can do whatever you want with your brush strokes, but in general, you should be mindful of the whole process from the beginning so that you don't run into annoying little problems later.